So I just got this little sucker in the mail the other day. Um, it looks kind of intimidating, but once you actually get used to it or read the instructions, it's not that complicated. Um, these are the little packs of uh, electrodes that I need to put on my chest, the batteries, etc. Okay, so I just took my shower. I'm ready to uh, put my halter monitor back. And the main reason that I'm using this halter monitor, which monitors your heart is because after a stroke it is kind of like a protocol to get your heart uh, checked just to make sure or rule out that uh, your heart is in trouble or something and thus ca causing your stroke mm -hmm. so while I was in the hospital um, they had me on a halter monitor for 48 hours and they also did a ECO or an echocardiogram and everything looked fine with my heart but my cardiologist just wanted to make uh, extra making me wear uh, another halter monitor for 30 days and I am also and by the way guys uh, my speech is coming flowing out way better now which is a great thing really and I haven't really even had my speech therapist yet. Um, I was instructed to have my speech therapist when I got out of the hospital and my primary care doctor also um, referred me to um, speech therapist, but I haven't had him as, as of now, which is ridiculous. We have him like going back and forth with uh, the insurance and uh, but uh, I'm actually doing way better on my own, so yeah. All right, let's get going to this monitor. Okay, so first off, I'm gonna open these guys right here. Um, I can actually cut the monitor off when uh, I need to take my showers or or things like that, like if I go swimming or something, and then I can uh, put it back on and cut it on. So, so these are the little things that I stick into my chest and um, yep so I'm gonna go ahead and stick this in my chest um, so one goes right here the other one on the left side and one on the bottom left so that's where all the little sticky things like go I was saying um, when I wore the, the 48 hour uh, halter monitor in at the hospital, um, the results came back um, normal. They didn't see any arrhythmias or something. On, yep. And I mean, you know, I mean, I understand the doctors always want to take the extra safe step, you know, like to really make sure that everything is absolutely right with you and your heart. So now I'm going to insert this battery, this new battery into this guy right here, which is what I put on my neck. And it goes right here. So I place place the battery already, and I'm just gonna cut. Uh, oh no! I need to actually first clip this on to my sticky things on my chest, and then cut this one on. And so this is how it hangs over my neck. Um, I have two electrodes up here on each side, and I have one on my lower left goes right there so uh, I, all I need to do now is cut this guy on which is the one right here and then it, it starts yeah so it's, it takes a pretty while good while to initiate so so there we go uh, it's ready to go and oh it's very good on the other thing Oh yeah, it is good. So that's how much battery I have on my monitor, on both monitors, this one and this one. And so yeah, I'm ready to start getting monitored again. So um, this guy right here also actually sends my yeah, the, the heart waves to my actual cardiologist. So oh, yeah, and almost forgot to mention um, with this little device right here. I can record any symptoms that I might have, like for example, if I feel palpitations or shortness of breath or whatever, you just I just record my symptom. So I will click over here. 
And if I wanted to record a symptom, which I'm not, uh, I can select skip it, lightheaded, short breath, heart racing, uh, fainted, dizzy, chest pain, and other. But I'm not gonna, I don't have any symptoms, so nope. So yeah, and so I'm putting the device to sleep, and it's still on, but uh. I just put it to sleep and yep so that's it I'm ready to go uh, so this is my uh, hotel monitor routine and hope you find this useful if you're about to use one or if you got prescribed one uh, don't be intimidated by it um, and good luck